Now we are going to see a play called Nahamandala. It is written by Girish Karnad. This play starts with the character called Man. Man is a playwright. He used to write plays. The people who used to see his plays, they used to sleep in the middle of the play because he will bore his play with his writings. So he got a gas. In order to get a remedy from the gas, he went to a saint. The saint told that he should not sleep for a month. But he thought that it is unable to sleep for a month. So he so he started to sleep. So the end of the month also came and he thought that for these days we have slept well. So at least this is the last day we should make we should be we should be awake in the, in, the, in this day. So he went to a temple, there he saw a um, wonder thing that he saw there are some flames which are coming from different houses. They are talking with each other. Among them one flame says that I came from a home in which there are there is a um, there are husband and wife. Uh, wife there the wife saw a, a woman from from his husband's from her husband's room so it is a it is an imaginary of wife wife because wife thinks that his husband has some illicit her husband has some illicit relationship with some some, some other woman so it is only the image, imagination of wife that she uh, sees a woman coming from his husband's room. So why the wife sees the woman, the woman also sees the wife and the, as she, as the woman sees the wife, she runs off, runs out of the house and all the flames ask at the time that who is the woman and where the woman is coming, where the woman is going, going out. And the flame said that now the flame said that, that now the woman is coming to the temple only. So all the flames waited for the woman and the women also arrived. At the time they cast the women and asked where are they coming from and how you got out from the husband's room. Uh, and the woman answered, while well, uh, before answering the flames, um, the man interpreted the conversation and he asked about the story of uh, the women. And the, women started to narrate a story and this is the the women started to narrate the story this is the story of the Naha Mandala now, now only the main story of the Naha Mandala is going to start first the character, main character is Rani Rani is a young girl she was married to a man called Appanna Appanna used to um, lock Rani inside the room and he used to go go to sleep with his mistress but Rani does not know what is happening in, in his house and where her husband is uh, uh, going after uh, after um, morning when Appana used to close the room um, with lock in the morning and uh, next morning only he, he used to come and uh, all nights uh, Rani used to sleep in lo loneliness at the time, a woman called Kurwada, she is blind and uh, his son named called Appanna. Both of them were coming to Rani's house in order to see Appanna because Appanna's mother, mother's friend is Kurwada. In order to see um, Kurwada's friend's son, he, Ra, Kurwada came to Appanna's house. There he saw, there he sees only Rani. And Kurwada comes to know that Appana is going to going out daily. And Kapana complains that he is going to sleep with his mistress. So everyone understands that Rani also comes to know that Appana is going to sleep with his mistress without considering his her, 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 without considering her real wife. And uh, Kurwada gave uh, gave two mythical roots to get the get love of Appanna. So, Rani mixed the 
mixed first root a small root uh, in the in aparna's food but it it, it attacked uh, aparna it attacked aparna aparna got fever and so rani thought that as i gave a small root my husband was um, attacked if i give the long root surely he he, he, may, he may die so rani thought that instead of getting love for, love from my uh, husband i need uh, he, i need apana to be li, li, uh, live live long so rani did not uh, gave the uh, long series of root to apana so she poured the root paste into the snakes snakes paste so in that snakes uh, snake licked the paste and snake got love with uh, rani and uh, snake used to come to home come to home in the in the night time and snake snake will appear in the form of her husband aparna so rani could not identify whether whether it is a snake or aparna so daily the snake used to visit rani's home in the night and uh, aparna used to come morning and uh, the snake naga is used to come in the night night times so rani is confused because aparna used to behave harsh uh, in the morning but naga used to behave in a romantic manner in the night so rani has several questions but he but whenever he tried to ask his questions both um, naga and aparna makes rani to be silent and uh, days gone by rani rani ga, rani gets pregnant and uh, it is it is known by aparna so aparna uh, blamed rani that she, rani got illicit relationship with some other some other some other so aparna took rani to the elders to get justice that the elders told that rani should hold a um, hot iron rod but rani says said that uh, i will i will uh, i will um, put my hand into the snake's place so, so so if snake bites me i had an illicit relationship uh, with some other girls or else if it not bites i am genuine Uh, rani says that like so uh, elders also accepted that and when rani um, made her, her hand to hand into the snake's place nothing happened uh, but snakes the, but the snake which is inside the um, play inside in its place became a garland in, in her uh, body and uh, in her uh, up of the head uh, it became a umbrella for uh, rani and everyone shocked to see the see that see the rani's appearance and rani's um, rani is with, with the, rani is saved from the biting of the snake so everyone th- thought that rani is a goddess so everyone uh, blamed aparna that she is um, she is aparna aparna that she is a goddess so aparna should serve rani Uh, everyone has um, uh, everyone is shocked because rani is not bitten by the snake this is only because naga said that said to rani in the in the night time that she should put his hand inside the um, snake's place so that it will not bite so rani also did that and the snake also did not bite that now rani aparna um are stayed at the home apana does not here after he does not go to um, go to his mistress and apana now started to sleep with rani and when naga come, comes comes in the night naga is shocked that apana sleeps with him and naga thought that if he interferes them then rani's life will uh, will be will be disturbed so naga went into the 
hair of rani and he died and and the story ends in this manner while the women narrating the story the flames are um, very sad to see to hear a tragic story so they ask the man to correct the story into a good a good a good ending so the man corrected the story that the naga went into the um, rani's hair but he did not die one day when rani is combing her home naga fell down and he does not die and uh, rani when naga fell fell down she understands that her life became a um, became a good uh, became a good when the naga when the snake came to came into his life so that rani says to naga that to return back to to her hair so naga also come return back to the to her hair and now naga apanna rani and her son are living in a, in the, the same house and the story ends in this manner this is a myth, mythological uh, story and uh, this pictures that um, women are suppressed and the, the women should attain a god power to be considered equal to her husband this is a um, moral of the story and uh, girish karna is trying to say that women are uh, give, should be given equal rights they they should be treated with the equal to their husband and this and, and in this story there are uh, there, there are lot of um, moral and lot of ethics good ethics in this story and uh, girish karna is a indian writer with mythology the touch he gave a relationship with a woman and a cobra and this is a, this is a this is a this is a reason for bringing the title called nagamandala thank you